Hi everybody, this is Brenda. I'm just going to share with you how to do one of the great quests in the Pine River Library Imagine Your Story Challenge. So this one is the send a scroll and we're going to send a card or a note to somebody and um, in your packet you'll find an envelope like this and we're going to take everything out of here and then um, with a piece of white folded card all you're going to need for this is um, a glue stick or some kind of adhesive, a pair of scissors and I like to use a needle. You don't have to have that. So we're going to start off putting our card together. Just use a glue stick to put some and all of them look a little bit different. Yours might be a different colour or have different things in it but I'm just going to put some glue on this one and stick it on here like this. And then you've got a long piece of pattern paper and you might want the butterfly side or you might want the spotty side up to you. I think I'm going to do the spots. I kind of like spots. And I'm uh, just going to stick this on here. But maybe over here. And then um, I've got a little piece. Ooh. And you can do yours however you want. You don't have to do it like this. It's really up to you. I'm going to show you my kind of um, pattern that I did. And uh, I'm excited to see whatever you get up to. So I'm going to put this piece on top like this. And then there's two butterflies in here. And uh, I'm going to cut them out. But I'm not going to cut them really carefully. I'm just going to cut like a border around it. And you don't have to, you know, you can do yours whatever you want. So Sorry, it's boring to watch somebody cut stuff. Here we go. And you might want to get someone to help you with this. So this is the, always the challenge. Is like, do you cut round those antenna, or do you just chop them off? <laughs> no, it's up to you. I'm going to put these on here, and then the other one I'm going to use one I cut out already, so you don't have to watch me cut two. So I've got two butterflies, and then there's also a little bow. And so you can decide how you want to have them look on your card. And like I say, you could do it this way if you wanted or however you feel like. Now the one thing with the butterflies and the ribbon is they don't stick really well with the um, glue stick. So I'm going to fold my butterflies in half like this. And then I put in your kit these little glue dots and they're kind of a pain to work with because they're so sticky. But that's why we love them. And this is when I use my needle. I get my, I don't touch them. I get my needle underneath, or you could use your scissors. And then I lift it off, and I'm going to stick my dot on top of it. That's how it sticks on there, real good. And then I peel the little paper piece off. And then I'm going to put, press that real hard on there. And then wrong side. When you touch these with your hands, they like stick and they immediately turn into like a booger on your hand and you can't get them off and it's really annoying. So I'm going to put two in the middle of each butterfly like this. You might be able to get away with one. And then press them on real good with the paper and then pick the paper off. But try to leave the glue on there. But then you'll find it, it bends in half and so now I can stick my butterflies like this. I can kind of fold my wings up and then the final thing is my card and I can write my little message inside and then the final thing with this is this bag that it came in is actually your envelope so on the back here you can write who it's to like if you're sending it to your grandma or if you're handing it to your neighbor you just put the somebody that you see you can just put their name on here if you want to put it in the mail you can write their name and address and your return address up here and then you slide it in this envelope and then look it looks so pretty like as your card that you can give out and then this peels off and you stick it on and then one thing to let you know is if you're going to put it in the mail you can put it in the mail like this but you have to have your stamp on the outside if your stamps on the inside the post office don't write that so you have to put your stamp on the outside and then you're good to go. Send your crow, scroll and you and you got your gem and you did another one of the quests. Have a great day. Bye.